Okay, originally I wanted to uh, try to squeeze two of these packs inside here. As you saw in that uh, time-lapse video, I was trying to work on the spacing. Um, there wasn't quite enough room in there for two of these, so I went ahead and just put one in. Uh, that, that will reduce my runtime by about two and a half hours. So originally, with these four amp hour, this four amp hour pack here, it would have been about 10 hours of runtime. Um, so that would be five to one uh, transmission to receive. So now we're, we're cut that down to seven and a half hours, which this is gonna be kind of a novelty radio that I play with. So I can't, I can't see myself running for seven and a half hours anyway. Um, some other things you're going to notice, I do have a little gap here that's not on the, that's not on the original pack. Uh, that's just the uh, internal parts here. Not quite enough space, so it, it does offset a little bit there, which isn't a big deal for me. And some of you might be a little upset with me. I drilled a hole here to install a um, power pole connector little 3d printed uh, power pole um, panel from another from another project that I did earlier but that's the rebuild there so saved about a little over a pound I guess uh, with the new batteries but time to get out and do some operating um, I'll, I will post uh, the link for this pack in the description and thanks for watching